Today's organic conversion video, I am going to discuss synthesis of metabromotoluene from toluene. First step is the nitration of toluene. We will be getting orthonitotoluene and paranitotoluene because CH3 is an electron donating group, so it is an ortho and para director. Orthonitotoluene is liquid and paranitotoluene is a solid. We can perform a crystallization to separate the mixture. Now we have a paranitotoluene. It can react with palladium charcoal in presence of hydrogen. Nitro converts to NH2. We are getting paratoluidine. When paratoluidine is treated with acetic anhydride, in acetylation takes place and we are getting anilide. Next step is the bromination. Here methyl and NHCOCH3 both are ortho para director because both are electron donating group. But para position is blocked in both the cases. So bromine can come either this position with respect to methyl ortho position or the ortho with respect to NHCOCH3. Here NHCOCH3 dominate over methyl. So bromine will come ortho with respect to NHCOCH3. Next step is the deprotection of anilide group. For that, we are using potassium hydroxide followed by strong heating, NHCOCH3 convert to NH2. Then we have to perform a diazotization reaction in presence of sodium nitride, hydrochloric acid at 0 degree Celsius, NH2 convert to diazonium chloride. Then we have to heat this diazonium chloride with H3PO2, then N2Cl minus remove, here hydrogen comes. That means we are getting metabromotoluene.